and the silly rumors just keep coming. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for another top 10 crazy rumors about celebrities. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're ranking more of the most insane, ridiculous, and unbelievable celebrity rumors that people actually believed. If you don't see a rumor you think should have been on this list, be sure to check out our original video of the top 10 crazy rumors about celebrities. Number 10. Cher had her ribs removed to appear thinner. I saw a woman on television once I even made a call. She said she was going to have her rib cage, some of her ribs removed like I had. And it just, it, was, it shocked me that someone would go and do something like that thinking that I had done it. The entertainment industry loves them some thin performers, so it's no surprise that rumors regarding celebrities' weights have circulated for about as long as celebrities have been a thing. Case in point, the infamous rumor that Cher had ribs removed to appear thinner. She had a bottom rib surgically removed so she'd have more of an hourglass figure. Don't you know, stars are flawed? However, like most of the female celebrities before her who have also been the subject of such rumors, Cher has long denied any semblance of rib removal. It wouldn't even occur to me because I have, I mean, I have a small rib cage. It just wouldn't occur to me to do something like that. She stated, quote, I didn't even know there was an operation that could remove your ribs. She has also hilariously stated, quote, you'd have a scar and everyone's seen pretty much my entire body. Number 9. Selena Gomez broke up Brangelina. So what did you decide? I want a divorce. September 19th, 2016 was a date that shocked the entertainment world, as it was the day Angelina Jolie filed for divorce from Brad Pitt after two years of marriage. And according to some conspiracy theorists, the finger of blame points to Selena Gomez. Gomez posted a picture to Instagram of her sitting next to Brad Pitt at the Golden Globes earlier that year, and many news outlets immediately pounced, claiming that Jolie was furious at Pitt for supposedly flirting with the young woman. Eight months later, Jolie filed for divorce. However, Jolie claims that the divorce stemmed from Pitt's alleged anger issues and substance addictions. Except to say it was a very difficult time, and, and we are a family, and we will always be a family. Number 8. Michael J. Fox's middle name is Jello. There are those that believe Michael J. Fox's real name is Michael Jello Fox. This has got to be a dream. According to legend, Fox was born without a middle name, which was rectified when he was six, and his parents allowed him to choose Jello as a nod to his favorite treat. But in actuality, Fox's real middle name is Andrew. So why the J? According to the actor, there was already a Michael Fox registered in the SAG, and because no two actors can share a name, he added the J as an homage to his favorite character actor, Michael J. Pollard. Number 7. Drake spent thousands of dollars on Taylor Swift's cats to win her heart. Cause baby, now we got bad blood. You know it used to be mad love. So take a look what you've done. Cause baby, now we got this story boils down to how much you trust a supposed insider. According to an anonymous source who allegedly knows Drake, Drake went on a massive shopping spree and showered Taylor Swift's cats with gifts to win his way into her heart. According to the insider, quote, he knows how much she adores her cats and Drake wants her to know that he adores her just as much. However, there seems to be no proof aside from this insider's supposed first-hand knowledge, and the two are definitely not a couple. Still a cute story though or possibly creepy, but anyway. Number 6. Cal Ripken Jr. missed a record-setting game because he was busy beating up Kevin Costner. In 1995, Cal Ripken Jr. beat the MLB record for most consecutive games played at 2,131. His streak finally ended in 1998 at 2,632 consecutive games. However, according to rumor, the streak almost ended in 1997 because Ripken was busy beating up Kevin Costner. Supposedly, Ripken caught Cosner in bed with Mrs. Ripken and, as such, couldn't make it to the game. His team and ballpark crew members, in turn, sabotaged the stadium's lighting equipment to preserve his streak. However, it's easily proven that Ripken was in fact at the stadium that day through witnesses and possible camera footage. In other words, he was not busy beating up Kevin Costner. Number 5. Stevie Nicks Blew Cocaine Up Her Butt it's no secret that Fleetwood Mac's Stevie Nicks has loved her some cocaine. I used, I used to carry a gram of cocaine in my boot at all times. And it was the first thing I thought of when I woke up in the morning and the last thing I thought of before I went to bed. 
She suffered such a huge addiction to cocaine throughout the 80s that she was warned by a plastic surgeon that she could drop dead upon the very next snort and, according to Nix, she had burned a hole through her nose. And anytime you do this drug, you could basically your next your last hit of coke could be your last hit of anything. This, in turn, resulted in a rumor that she was so addicted to coke that she ingested it through her anus to avoid further damage to her nose. The rumor was so widespread that Nix was forced to finally put an end to it in 2001, calling it absurd. Number 4. Leah Michelle is illiterate the rumor that Leah Michelle is illiterate started when two fans, Jay Hunt and Robert Ackerman, posited a ridiculous theory that Michelle couldn't read due to her theatrical background. She literally can't read at this stage. Yeah, I life. mean, this is too young to read. And so her parents would read her her lines. They'd be like, Leah, Dada. And she'd be like, Dada. And then like, she would like remember the lines. Some people on social media then began to pick up the story, and a ridiculous rumor was born. She Now, <clears> let's <throat> watch again. She says, Columbia, signing on the artist wall. Signing on the artist wall. No, she's not. Putting a line under your name is not signing. The rumor even stated that Michelle couldn't read her Glee scripts and simply memorized what the writers and directors told her to say. Not only do I have to memorize pages and pages, they said that Ryan oh Murphy would have to right. read the lines to me. Yes. Ryan called me, he's like, do, do, do people think that I have the time in my right. life to come and do this? Michelle took it in stride, writing on Twitter, quote, loved reading this tweet and wanted to write you back, proving that yes, Michelle can read and write. Or can she? Dun dun dun. Uh, Lee Michelle cannot read or write, but that's not true. She can't read, write, or speak. She can't even swim or walk. She can't do anything. She can't do anything right. She's horrible. Number three, Gene Simmons has a cow tongue. Gene Simmons certainly has a noteworthy tongue, but a cow's tongue it is not. A rumor spread in the 70s claiming that Simmons had a cow's tongue implanted and grafted onto his own to make it appear larger. Is it true that Gene Simmons had a cow's tongue grafted onto his real tongue? I think he uh, had the piece of skin under his tongue removed so he could stick it out farther. According to the rumor, this in turn would drum up publicity for the band and cement their status as one of rock's weirdest and most unique acts. However, anyone who has ever seen a cow's tongue knows that there's no way this is true. Simmons has since described this as his favorite rumor and wrote in his autobiography that it is indeed his natural tongue. All right, all right, keep it in your mouth, rockstar. Number two, Marilyn Manson was in The Wonder Years. There's been many a rumor about Marilyn Manson and his eccentricity. And then there's this one that says Manson was a child actor who starred in The Wonder Years. According to the rumor, Manson played Paul Pfeiffer on The Wonder Years, before reimagining himself as a satanic shock rocker. So I guess it's just you and me for the dance on Friday, huh? Nope, I'm not going. What? As you can imagine, this is untrue, as Paul was played by Josh Saviano, who has since become a lawyer. Meanwhile, The Wonder Years aired from 1988 to 1993, at a time when Manson was attending Broward Community College and studying journalism. Sorry guys, we wanted this one to be true too. Number 1. Mama Cass Died Choking on a Ham Sandwich The lasting power to this rumor is rooted in how unsensational it is. The joke in Austin Powers certainly didn't help the public's perception of her death. Mama Cass, deceased, ham sandwich. According to the long-standing and oft-believed rumor, Cass Elliot, known to the world as Mama Cass, died choking on a ham sandwich. Choked on a ham sandwich. Just like Mama Cass. Just like Mama Cass. However, the truth is that Cass died in her sleep due to heart failure stemming from obesity. The story may have started because a half-eaten sandwich was found in her flat and speculation spread before the official autopsy could be completed. The rumor has persisted ever since. But uh, I, my blood sugar level dropped or something and yeah. I just sort of tipped over. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.